Hey, Tyler. Hey, that was fun going out there this morning. Um, it's good to see you out there getting your work in, and I'm enjoying working with you. What I want to do here, since this is our first go around, is point out one or two things um, that you do well, and there are more than one, and give you something to work on. Okay? Let's start with the good stuff. I like the way you load. I'm going to move the frame forward a little bit. And right here, I want to see the way, I want to watch the way that you get all your weight on your backside, but you have a good bend in your knee, and you're sitting right here, you're, you're bending at the waist, okay, you're bending at the waist over home plate, so your head, your head is moving toward home plate. That's all great stuff, okay, and, and it's like, all your weight is going down into the ground. So it's like you're almost like you're sitting in a chair. Let's let's run it back again. Here you go. Sit. All your weight going down and you're sitting in that chair. That's really good. Okay. Also really like the way you make a, a frame or a box with your arms. Okay. The lead arm is a letter L back one okay is kind of a V which is fine it's but it's really good positioning right there you have to make that frame or that box with your arms and keep your lead elbow bent and as we scroll forward we're gonna stop when that front foot hits the ground which as you know that's what we talked about a lot um, in the drill this morning and what you do is here is a really good job of keeping your hands up tight to your body, up by your back shoulder. And again, I talk about that lead elbow bent, that letter L frame. That is super. All good stuff, Tyler. Now what I want to move to is, again, I'm going to advance you till your front foot hits the ground, particularly your front heel. And we're going to do the drill we did this morning. Where we're going to go play, pause, Right? That's what we talked about. Pause when your heel hits the ground and the position you need to be in when that front heel hits the ground. We talked about this, your shoulder tilt. See you're going uphill. Your lead shoulder is, is higher than your back shoulder. And what we're shooting for is this angle. And one of the ways you can do that is taking this back, this back elbow and kind of getting it up there a little bit. Okay, and if that back elbow goes up, the lead elbow has to come down a little bit. You have to make sure that your elbows stay the same distance apart from there to there. Okay, and you keep them the same distance apart. So if you're going to move this elbow this way, this elbow has to go that far that way. Okay, and that will help get you in that position we talked about with your shoulder tilting down. All right, Tyler. That's going to be it for today. I'd like to see you work on that shoulder tilt when that front heel hits the ground like we did today. Play. Let's run it back again, I guess. So we're going to push play, pause, but the shoulder needs to be this way, and then play. I like the way you're working at it, Tyler. I like your swing. Let's work on that one. Shoot me another video, and we'll talk about it.